Test one, two, we're in action, baby. Guys, uh, my first time snow geese hunting. Uh, I'm out with uh, the Backwoods boys. Uh, they were kind enough. I took them fishing this summer, and uh, we're teaming up. And uh, here I am in uh, northeastern Alberta for goose. I got my calls today. Grew up duck hunting, goose hunting. Super excited about it. Haven't done it in probably over 10 years now, and uh, I'm just excited about it. We they uh, they dragged along Rick here, and Rick's the pro. He gave us the game plan. We got about seven eight hundred decoys out which was quite a bit of work for me but uh we made it happen and uh we're going an hour from shooting time so hopefully the birds start going we got a good wind today should be good see you a bit Five fifteen in the morning and uh luckily for all of us we we're in bed early probably nine o'clock we are now in the field we're about 40 minutes away from the farm give or take and uh our weather today is supposed to be 18 degrees at peak. By the time this legal shoot, it's going to be 11. I've never hunted like this before, but uh, it's time for about a thousand deeks. And uh, pretty early morning, but it's my first goose hunt of the year, and man, am I excited! So stay tuned. I hope to God we got some snows coming in. We got some, we got some Canadas, and we got some ducks. The scout yesterday was good, and uh, field was full. But let's see if our spread works today. Okay, and the blinds are going to be here. I'm going to put a kill hole. And we're gonna all this part here is all gonna be birds. Okay, and this is gonna be like seven, six, seven hundred yards that way. Okay. Okay, so they come in and they trail up. They wanna land here or come over our heads. If they land here, they'll basically we can let them land. When they pop up and continue into the wind, yeah. that's when we hammer them. Okay, the lights are in bags. Yeah. The really light yeah, decoys. Yeah. yeah. The ones we bought. Yeah. Put those, start making your thing. The heavies, when you're done the lights, unloading the lights, yeah. bring the chairs and the heavies here, okay. and then we'll start making the, the setup here. Okay, we're going to salt and pepper in them, so we're going to put four there, and then we're going to put four there, and four here on the outside. We're going to put some behind us, small groups of, of the greys, because if you look last night, yeah. there was greys in there, That's right. but they were all just small groups, right? So let's make it as realistic as possible. Don't face all the geese into the wind. Face them all over because they're comfortable. You face them all into the wind, that's a, a flock that's ready to take off. They're scared, right? Yeah. Okay. So that kill hole is pretty important. I'll set up the flyers right here. And we're going to have a couple speckle bellies going across just to, just to make it a little bit more realistic. Don't set them up like an army. One here, one there. Like, Don't make a line. Yeah. Remember what we did with yeah. them? Yeah. Spread Not them out. Not cool. Spread them out. Okay. And spread them out and make them look like they're walking and feeding because that's what snow geese do right they don't stay still right. we got a wind today so the rags are really going to look good yeah. so make sure when you're putting the rags out you shake them nice so they have a nice pocket and the wind's going to blow them up right yeah okay okay sweet off the roll game time look at this looks real to you looks real to me Here's, here's what I find funny is that I know tomorrow morning, or maybe even later today, I'm gonna get a call from Jordan Walsh and it's gonna be, hey, like how'd the hunt go? How good, how good was everything? I say, well, we slaughtered him. He goes, perfect, I'm on the way up tomorrow. So he's not here to see if they if, if we get him or not, but he'll be here tomorrow if they shoot well. So Jordy Walsh, I know your tricks. If anybody is standing, there's no shooting at all. Even if somebody's back there, 
we got to be very clear that nobody's going to be shooting unless told to do so. You can talk loud, you can move a little bit, don't get in a hurry to shoot. Get up and pick a bird. I find there's no flaps open like you do in a, in a coffin blind, okay? They're not scared at all. You get up and, and get on them, they're not flaring at all. They flare when you shoot, okay? They want movement, they, they expect movement in, in the spread. So don't get up and like panic your first shot. Make sure your first shot counts. The other two are just backups basically. That's about it. Just talk. Um, my decoys aren't very expensive, but they're very expensive if you shoot, if you shoot them. What if you run them over? That's the thing. Good job! 
Peace. <laughs> 